Hello, boys and girls. This is your happy, this is the second violin, Happy Hanukkah, Happy Hanukkah, um, practice video, All right? This piece is a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun. Almost all the parts are almost the same, um, but it's so much fun, okay? So, beginning, your first line is introduction. So, you're going to put your first finger on your D string, and you're going to go back and forth with your bow. And your bow is going to be going. Now, what I'd like you to do, because you have this rhythm all the way through, is just get on your A and just play the rhythm. Play the first line, just the rhythm on your A string. The trick to playing this is that your first down bow in every measure has to be a slow bow. That's the trick. You've got to go slow, fast, slow. Because if you do everything the same speed, you're going to run out of bow. So you have to go slow, fast, slow. So it's slow, fast, slow. So just practice on your A string. Slow, fast, slow. So slow, fast, slow. in the bottom part of your bow. You don't want to get up here. Okay? Okay, so then add that rhythm to the bow chip, to the string change. So it's going to be A, B, 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 A, then you put your first finger on the D string and you got this, you got this. And the next thing at letter A, what's the first thing you do? Very important. The first thing you do is rest. First thing you do is rest. So you're going to go rest, 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 rest. Now, I like the bowing down, stop, down, up. Down, stop, down, up. Rest, down, down, up. Rest, down, down, up. Rest, down, down, up. And then you're going to do something that's a little tricky, and you have it with the violas. You leave your first finger right where you have it on the D string, and you put that two on the G so you can go. Okay? Same bowing as the first four measures, except it's on the G and D string. Same thing, though, slow, fast, slow, fast, slow, right? That way you don't lose control, okay? And then at letter, at number nine, same thing, measure nine. Then low two, A, A, one. Leave your one there, A, one, A, one, A, one, back to A. And remember, when you go back to A, the first thing you do is rest, okay? So let's do letter A. Take the first ending and repeat back to A, and then take the second ending. All right, here we go. Letter A as in angels. That's what it looks like. Okay, here we go. Ready? Remember the first thing you do at A is? That's right. You rest. Here we go. One, two, ready, and rest. 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 before B. Now, I want to tell you something. I, I told my violas this already. I want to tell my first student. But I have been teaching Happy Hanukkah for 42 years. I started teaching Happy Hanukkah in 1980. No lie. So, um, 
I have heard the same mistakes over and over. So one of the mistakes is someone always play, tries to play the measure before B just like measure 12. It's not the same. Look at the measure before B and then look at measure 12, which is the last measure in the first ending. You see that? It's different. The last, me the ma last measure in the first ending, which is measure 12, goes and the measure before B is you don't have that extra little note. Now, every year I teach this, someone plays the extra note. Yeah, I've done it, okay, I'm sure at some point, but everybody does. So don't worry about it. If you do it, just say, ah, I did it. It's the only time I'll have to do it, okay? So be careful there. So B is just A, 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 A. Rest, rest, rest. Three. Back to A, N. High two on the A, N. to be. Rest, rest, rest. Rest, rest, rest. Second finger high on the A, go. Three, four. Now, and that measure, uh, and measure 23, which is the second ending, play three, four, three, four. Don't try going over the place, okay? You got enough to worry about without your bow going flipping out, okay? And then letter C is just like letter A, right? Okay, and then at letter D, something different happens. D as in different. You have nice whole notes. I know how notes, half notes. So half note, 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 half note. Half note. It's really important to remember, look at your key signature. You have no sharps and no flats in there, which means that your twos are low pretty much everywhere, except on the G. And I don't think we have to worry about that note. Your twos are low, 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 okay, very low, okay? So two, let's, let's start at letter E, as in elves, and we're going to play that slowly. Okay, about like, don't even worry about the bowing. Let's get the notes first, okay? Let's do it slowly. Letter E as in elves, and. Move your two to the D. And you can play open there. Move two straight over, straight over. trickiest measure to me is measure 40, 41 because all of a sudden you have a different rhythm there. No, you don't. I was, I, would, I just had a, what was it? I just had a hallucination. Okay. Okay. Let's try it with the bowing. Okay. So you just need to practice this. You know, let's talk about practicing for a second. A little commercial announcement here in the middle of your practice video. Um, practicing is extremely important. I, I'm trying to teach all my students how to practice. All these little tips I give you about how to practice things. Don't ever be afraid just to practice. Don't, now, don't practice stuff you can already play. You need to practice the stuff you can't play. You need to figure it out and get it right. So when you go in rehearsal, you know, you can play it. And you can, you know what it's like when everybody plays together and everybody's pitching in. Well, you've got to be able to be, do your part. So don't practice stuff you can already play. Don't play stuff that's easy and you already know. Practice stuff that needs to be practiced. In this place at E, you have, even though it's a it's an alto line, it's still a melodic, interesting line that's going on there. So it really needs to be played correctly. Okay? So let's do that. You really need to get that from E to measure, oh, what measure is that? 40, 41, 42, 342. Okay, so let's try that. Remember? 
use a lot of bow. Ready? One. And Miss Caitlin Collins, Miss Collins may have told you to use four in, in uh, second measure after E and the fourth measure after E. And if she tells you to use four, try to use four. Um, if you don't use four for me, I will be okay. There are times to use four, but um, I really want to make sure that that note's in tune because it's a long note. All right. So let's try it from E, from, from um, Elves. One. Two and ready, go. music because it doesn't fit on the screen so let me move it down a little bit okay so let's start letter let's start letter g okay ready g one which is um glitter is that a good one okay glitter one two a second finger low on the a string one two ready go <laughs>